Hello, I'm George Adams. I'm President and CEO of SSH Communication Security Incorporated, and we provide solutions for securing and managing file transfers and data in transit in enterprise networks in order to help companies really secure their information flows throughout the organization and between organizations. In this way, we help the, these companies uh, achieve regulatory compliance, uh, governance for their IT operations. This allows companies to remediate risk within the uh, networks and avoid breaches, which as uh, many know can cause millions of dollars in real loss, but also very, very real loss in company credibility, customer confidence, and um, uh, perception in the marketplace for your organizations. Back in the 90s, we were talking about HIPAA, for example, for healthcare organizations, insurance companies, and others uh, to protect patient data. More recently, in the uh, uh, early 2000s, uh, Sarbanes-Oxley and SOX compliance became key for public companies in order for them to protect confidential information and be able to show how information flowed you know, for financial transactions and the uh, uh, various operations that they were doing. But more, uh, more recently, and more relevantly uh, to organizations today, uh, the PCI DSS requirements, the uh, Payment Card Industry Data Security Standard requirements are really key. One would think that they're mainly for retailers or people that are doing a lot of credit card transactions, but if you think about it, every company uh, buys and sells with credit cards these days and needs to protect credit card holder information in order to be in compliance with the PCI DSS needs. And these mandates are enforced by the uh, credit card organizations and um, bring penalties, but also serve as a good footprint and um, guideline for companies to use in uh, best practices you know, for protecting their networks. Uh, some of the things that are required include encrypting data as it flows through the organization so that it's uh, unable to be seen by people that are trying to steal that information. Uh, others require audit trails so that you can see who had access to which information at what time, as well as being able to um, enforce uh, policies for data access and information for the credit card information and the uh, cardholder information. Other, other aspects have to do with uh, how long you hold credit card uh, personal information and so forth. But uh, when we look at how we protect that, we provide a whole range of uh, capabilities for encrypting the data, for authenticating who has access to the data at what time, as well as uh, setting and enforcing policy for uh, access to data throughout corporate networks. Our products and services really provide capabilities at three levels. Uh, at the governance level, you have the ability to manage the network and uh, manage operations, enforce policy you know, within the network. At the automation layer, you have the means for automating the ability to uh, detect FTP file transfers, for example, and automatically convert those into um, secure file transfers, as well as the ability to set up uh, managed file transfer operations and direct file transfer flow uh, throughout the network. And then we have a whole range of capabilities for securing your infrastructure. These are the ability to, for each node in the network, to be able to send or receive uh, secure files, the ability to um, uh, authenticate you know, both ends of connections for true end-to-end -end security, and doing this across the whole range of uh, Windows, Linux, Unix, and IBM ZOS and Linux for Z uh, platforms. These are crucial in that uh, every company has multiple platforms in their environment, and the ability to op operate end-to-end -end through any points in the network is a very key requirement in these areas. Now at the governance level, we have a, a brand new product that were just announced uh, that uh, really gives you a whole new range of capabilities for governance capability, for uh, the ability to monitor encrypted traffic within the network. And this is often a requirement that uh, to be able to use the encryption uh, capabilities, you, you need to be able at uh, certain points in the network flow, monitor the content and uh, of those uh, data packets in order to know that you don't have malware or you don't have malicious activity going on. Uh, the other thing that this, uh, our new product, which is uh, SSH Tectia Guardian, the Guardian product gives you the ability to monitor the encrypted SSH or SFTP uh, 
uh, RDP and uh, as well as non-encrypted telnet traffic you know, within the network. And you can then uh, trace and monitor the flow of configuration changes and of um, sessions you know, across the network you know, with this as a key tool for management and governance of the network as well as for um, forensic capability if there are uh, needs for those capabilities within the network environment. To directly complement the uh, SSH TechDia Guardian product are services that we offer for to help customers uh, using the product to install, configure, monitor, and report you know, for governance reasons uh, and for uh, auditing capabilities within their company environment. This can help people get to solutions more quickly. We have the in-house expertise to help uh, complement the expertise of our customers in order to help get to deployment and to get to governance more quickly than virtually any solution on the market. And if you'd like further information about our whole range of SSH TechDia products and services, as well as our new Guardian product, please go to ssh.com.